Hello, thanks for joining me today for another video guide. In this video, we'll be showing you the step-by-step -step process to install a single user version of Vertex BD on your PC. The first step is to download and extract your copy of Vertex BD and open two window explorers, one with your download location of your copy of Vertex BD and the second with your computer's C drive open as well. Once you've both of those open side by side, like shown on the screen, you then need to copy the extracted program folder into your C drive as shown. Once this is completed, you then want to double click the folder you copied in your C drive and run the installation exe shown on screen. This will begin the installation program for Vertex BD. After the installer has started, the next step will be to select your chosen language from the drop down menu and click OK. A new window will then show. On this window, you will see the option of one user installation. For this guide, we will be using that option, so select this, which will then take us on to the next step. A full screen window will then open with a license agreement selection shown. Select yes from the options presented here, then a data collection agreement will be shown. Choose next on this screen. Once you've selected next, the installer will request where you would like the program to be installed. Due to us copying all the files onto the C drive at the start, this should already show the C drive location we used previously. So select next at this stage. Next, we will get a create shortcut prompt. Select OK to this and add a shortcut to your desktop. We will then get a license server installation pop-up. For this, select no, and then also select no for the next pop-up regarding the installation from a HASP drive. After skipping these, the installation will ask if you have a license.txt file you would like to use, but for this installation, we will be using a license key posts installation. So simply click next on this. After this, the installation parameters window will be displayed. Click next on this and the installation will take 5 to 15 minutes to complete and the installation will then have fully completed on your system. Once this is completed, if your system has previously had Vertex installed, you'll have to change the file extensions previously used to be associated with the new version of Vertex you're installing. So select yes to the file extensions the system finds and would like to associate to your new installation of Vertex. After this, the software will have fully completed the installation and you will be presented with an installation complete window where you simply select finish to complete the installation on your system as shown. The only thing left to do after this is then to open your Vertex BD you have installed and simply input your activation code you have received for use with your software. Once you have input that, select OK and the software will activate your license and then you're free to open Vertex BD and you can begin using your freshly installed software. Thanks for joining us again for another video. For more helpful guides and videos, check out our channel.